Hey, I'm here with my family, and we um, we stopped at Bucky's, and I feel like, on behalf of America, I need to taste a Bucky's um, brisket sandwich. Cause everybody says they're good, so we're gonna try that. Stand by. Straight out of the bag, you just pick it up in there. It's like a, I don't know. Called. It's I've never seen anything like it, but I'm confident if I'm going to catch a variant of the coronavirus, it's going to be here. All right, what we got here? It's just brisket on a bun. That's it. All right, first impressions. They flavored the mess out of this with fake. That's fake. Um, I think that's fake smoke seasoning in there. They pumped this full of something liquid smoke. It's good. It's it's not that great. It's not that great. It's a lot of salt and a lot of old. No, oh, make you think it tastes good. I'm not a fan of the Bucky's brisket. I mean, for a gas station brisket. It's good, but listen, the hype, there's all kinds of hype. Come on, it's just not, it's just not, just not worth it. I mean, it's worth $6. That's how much it costs. So, it was fun to go see Bucky's and risk my life for it and all that stuff. So, uh, I mean, their food is good. It was good. It was fun. It was a yeah. great family experience, but don't go there for the brisket sandwich. But if you got, like, I don't know, Arby's is probably better. I think there's probably better. So, if you got nothing else around, you got a Buggies, at least stop by. You heard it here first, America. This is for you.